I like how you can like run robots code them and test it with your friends and complete different challenges to learn how to do robotics. Matteo, Ariane and Patrick all started coding and robotics within the last two years at Zebra Robotics in Oakville. This year they formed a competitive team and named it after their initials, Team Map. We prepare like I think two or three months before, even like running the code and building it each day. That we had our first competition, it was regionals. So we coded a robot and then it had, it was like a map and then it had pieces of Lego. So basically there's a series of set challenges that you have to complete in two minutes. And we, we went for every single challenge. Some people just went for a few and didn't go for the rest. But that definitely secured our victory. After conquering regionals at the Ontario Science Centre, the team headed to the National Zone 1 Robotics Championships in Montreal last month. They had a disappointing first run, scoring only 15 points. They improved in their second, scoring 101 points. There was another team that had 114 points, and then the last run, we got 115 points, and we won. The whole team recommends other children give robotics a try. I would say that they should because it's really creative. You can you can make like a lot of designs with these Lego pieces and it's really fun. I enjoy building because I can use my imagination to build whatever I want. And they can already see how the skills they're learning today have a positive impact on their future. Well, I'd like to be a mechanical engineer when I'm older, so that way I can make cars, so this will probably definitely give me a higher chance to get into a better college or university. I want to go to like a good university like MIT and be a robotics engineer. But right now, they're proving that learning can be fun. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.